Here we have a 71 plate Audi A4 TFSI S-Line Black Edition. Now this vehicle comes with the white exterior paintwork. We do have the black styling pack on this vehicle. You can see the black Audi badge in the centre of the front grille. There's a look at that front end. You'll also find it the LED headlights. Coming around to the driver's side, you'll then find the 19 inch alloy wheels. We have the colour coded door handles, black door mirrors, black trim around the windows and the private glass for the rear passengers. Up top you find the shark front antennae, we also have the gloss black rear spoiler just here on the tailgate. We do also have front and rear parking sensors with a rear reversing camera. Again you've got the black Audi badging on the tailgate along with the A4 badging as well. Now if we just take a look at the interior, so coming into the back quickly You'll find we have the half leather seats, foldable armrests in the centre and fixed ISO points as well back here. We have the climate control with the vents for the rear passengers. Brush metal handles, gloss black trim and electric windows on the doors. Take a look at the front, you'll find the same half leather seats, it's got the S logo just there as well. Both front seats are being heated, there's a quick look at both of them. We then again have the electric windows, heated electric mirrors, automatic lights. Let's take a seat inside and you'll find the digital dashboard in front of us. Put a foot on the brake, press the start button, vehicle will start up. We do have the speedometer and the cruise control on this stalk here. Got paddle shifters either side of the steering wheel. We also have the automatic wipers on that stalk there. Digital dashboard, free from any warning lights. Plenty of different features on here. You can see we have the sat nav where we can have a full screen or a half screen. We also have the phone connectivity. We then have the media options and the trip computer. Main infotainment screen, just here in the center. It's touch screen. So you can see if you click onto home and you'll find we have all these different options and features which we can go through. We would have seen them all on the photos, but if we go through them quickly, you can see we have the sat nav navigation. We then have the phone connectivity for phone calls. We have a range of media options along with the radio stations as well. Let's turn the volume down. Back onto the main menu, if we go onto the apps, then you'll find we have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Now if this screen or any other lights are flickering in the car, it's just the camera, they're not flickering in real life. You can see we have the different drive modes just there as well. Again going on to the main menu, we can scroll through other, other options just there as well. Further down you've got the climate control, we have the ice cold air conditioning, heat seat buttons either side for both the front seats. We then have the drive select modes along with the auto start stop button traction control parking sensors and the button just there to turn the screen off 12 volt connectivity usb ports We've got the cup holders some storage space we also have the automatic gearbox put it into reverse you find the reverse camera and the parking sensors appear on the screen back into park by pressing p electric handbrake and auto hold button and finally the armrest just here in the center that's all i'm going to show you guys today though if you'd like to find out more please get in contact or check out the website this vehicle comes to a free nationwide delivery thank you for watching